very exciting things going on here today. We have uh, Ron Smith from Smith Aerospace, the inventor, creator of Dolphin Orca. Uh, this one's the Orca. And this is a new prototype. Uh, dynamic oscillating lateral fin is a uh, full description of the technology with the foils. I call it dolphin for short. Uh, all my fins are some form of a dolphin. This is the dolphin orca. This is a prototype of what will, I'm thinking, probably be called the dolphin X18. At least that's my working title. The name could possibly change. What you see here um, is 20 years in uh, development. It took Ron about 20 years to build what we have here today. We have two different models. We're gonna show you more details. We're gonna tell you the differences between them. But now we're gonna have Carlos, experienced freediver and good monofin swimmer. He's gonna be trying Orca for the first time ever. So let's get in the water and see it in action. Yeah. We'll give it a shot. Uh, this has a rigid wing, I thought so it'll have a lot more roll damping to it, a lot more resistance uh -huh. to movement this way. Um, it's oh, wow. kind of a double-edged <laughs> sword. It makes it harder to get crooked, but it also means that when it is crooked, it's harder to get it back. Um, yeah, it's a dynamic it's oscillating lateral like fin. Like that means the fin is supposed yeah, yeah. to be yeah. at a right <laughs> angle <laughs> to the kick <laughs> direction. Yeah, so you want to feel, you know, if the, the fin is crooked back there, yeah. you don't want to be kicking it like this. Either kick it like this or don't kick it at all. Just post and, and work it so back he, straight he again. And, guys, and please, you're ruining my sound. Um, We're gonna talk over there. Too. Yeah, do that. So if uh, you'll you'll probably be able to feel it. You know, if you get it crooked and you start kicking it this way, it'll probably slowly want to get worse and worse, and it'll feel really so weird, and you'll know something's wrong. Correct it. So, so yeah, just feel with your feet or take a look back and see what's going on and just you know get the fin straight eventually it'll you know get natural second nature you'll learn how to control it if you bring it like this back straight it will be a whole lot easier than trying to yank it like this um, so you'll find you'll do a lot of kind of adjusting adjusting your ankles you know I, 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 you know, once you get the feel for it, you can do full barrel rolls. You swim it along, just kind of angle the fin, mm -hmm. bring it like that, and you can you can do a half barrel roll, half flip, and turn around and swim the other direction very easily. But without knowing the technique, it can be kind of difficult. In the beginning, my recommendation to people is don't try to sprint with it. Don't try to do anything real amazing with it off the bat. Just get it in the water. And just slow light kicks and kind of start to get the feel for it and then as you get the control then you can do harder and more aggressive kick strokes with it and the only other thing that i can really think of at the moment to talk about are the binding straps yeah. when you put the fin on you just open these up i always put it on in the water i jump in and float pull one strap like that with tension on it pull this one back with a little tension on it Bring this kind of high up okay. over your foot, and then with tension on here, just rock this a little bit, and it'll kind of lock itself tight around your foot. If we burn our wings, flying too close to the sun, if the moment of glory over before it's begun If the dream is won Though everything is lost We will pay the price But we will not count the cost We will pay the price But we will not
What is your first impression, Carlos? Can you move? Do you feel like you can control it? Yeah, actually it feels easier than what I thought, actually. Is it comfortable? Very comfortable. Let's do some swimming. <laughs> 